I'm Liz Kodalik, student reporter with No99. And have you ever been to the Autobahn Center? Neither have I, so let's go check it out. The Nina Mason Pulliam Rio Salado Audubon Center has been open for just over a year and a half and we're in South Phoenix and we are one of the last um, Audubon centers that's been placed in an urban setting which is unusual for generally for nature centers Audubon and otherwise to be in an urban setting. Hello fellow nature lover! Unless you're a high heel walking expert like I am. You might want to bring another pair of shoes because although the trails are well maintained here, you're not walking down a runway. When walking through the Audubon Center, you are sure to see many beautiful and interesting things, like these flowers or this working water pump. And look at this! It's called a cienega, which is basically a wet habitat for wildlife. If you love birds, then the center's bird viewing peninsula is the place for you. This is a sign that identifies what kind of plants you're seeing. And you'll see lots of them. Like, look at these cute little flowers. Can you believe these grow in the desert? And look at these! They're pink! One thing that you might see here is lots of Arizona wildlife. Wait, look. Is that a lizard? That's sad. It's really important to connect youth with nature in particular because it really fosters a feeling of conservation for the future, that they want to take care of the place where they live. And if people aren't introduced to that at a young age, it's not really on their radar. It's impossible not to appreciate nature after visiting the Autobahn Center. But do you know what famous water source all of this is near? It's the Salt River bed. I mean, the river's dry now, but it used to flow right through Phoenix. Um, yeah, sometimes people come out and um, it tends to be people that don't spend much time outside and um, they just don't know what it's like. And that's not their fault, that's a, I would say that is a, the fault of education and that's why places like this are really important, is they teach you the value of nature and also how to respect it. So how to wear the right clothing, how you can get burned if you're not wearing long sleeve you know, shirts and how you're not wearing you know, closed-toed shoes, um, and when you're walking outside, how to make sure, you know, wear a hat, sunglasses are always good, um, and just be aware of your surroundings. Oh, pavement. Is that on? I was fine. Picturesque images of nature occupy every inch of the center, and you'll always find something interesting to marvel at. All in all, this is a great place for people to come and enjoy a little bit of Arizona wildlife. Mm -hmm.